Hey guys, it's Christy Sanders, your independent Cincy consultant. Welcome back to my house where I have the Valentine's collection to show you. So Cincy's Valentine's collection launched January 1st. I got my first shipment in of that collection and I thought you might like to see what's in it. I don't have every item, but I've got quite a few of them. But before I show you the Valentine's collection, let me show you something cute I did to my little gnome for uh, Christmas mini warmer. So y'all remember this mini warmer from Christmas? Oh, I was turning backwards. There he is. Um, I found these little felt hearts from uh, the Dollar Tree and put those on his hat and made him a, um, isn't that cute? A Valentine's warmer. So we're going to keep him out until Valentine's Day. And then these are just little stickies that'll rub right. I can peel those right off and get that sticky off. But isn't that cute? We also did that to our gnome for the holidays, the large gnome warmer that, um, since he put out for Christmas. We actually had him last year and we did that at Valentine's Day and it looked so cute to put the hearts on his hat and he looks like a Valentine's warmer too. So we're all ready for Valentine's Day around here and um, I needed this base to show you the mini warmer from our Valentine's collection and I thought that I'd just show you how we've made our little gnome into a, a Valentine's gnome as well. So all of our mini warmers can also be placed on a tabletop base and that's what this is so that I can show you what it looks like easier for video. So this is the ceramic base for the, um, so there's two different styles of the tabletop bases, ceramic and the glass one, but that works with the ceramic. And I want to show you our lit with love mini warmer this is part of our valentine's collection and this was actually offered last year as well and so we got this mini warmer last year but we've pulled it back out to put with our valentine's decorations so when you order the lit with love mini warmer it comes with this base that you can plug into the wall but i'm going to light it up and put it on the tabletop base for you but this is a it's actually a metal warmer but it does fit on the ceramic tabletop base, okay? Let me take that off and show you. It's got a glass dish, and it's filled with probably hundreds of these little heart cutouts, and they're so cute. So let me show you what it looks like lit up real quick, and then I'm going to show you what it looks like with a red bulb, because that's what I'm doing with it here at home. So here is the warmer. I'm going to put it up close so that the camera will pick up. And so when it lights up, when you've got it plugged into the wall, you get tiny little hearts on the wall behind it. And then, um, oh, I'm afraid it's not going to pick up. Maybe if I put it up close to the camera, it'll pick up. See all those tiny little hearts? It's cute as can be. But we have, um, I experimented a little and put a red bulb inside of it. You know, since he has colored bulbs for all of our size bulbs except for the 40 watt one so i put a red bulb in here for valentine's day and i want to show you what it looks like it also looks adorable if you just have a red or a pink wax in it because if you put the wax in it's got that clear dish and um and so it just it seems to kind of glow a red or a pink when you put not all of it but the top of it looks red or pink and so that's cute too but look at it with a can you see that with the red bulb? Oh, the camera's not doing it justice. I'm going to have to... It's not going to pick up on my auto autofocus, I don't think. It don't matter what I do with it. Well, I'll take a picture and put it in the comments um, and show y'all what it looks like with the red bulb. But it's really cute. Um, you just have to use your imagination until I get that picture up, okay? But this is the Lit with Love warmer. I think that's the name of it. I hope I'm not getting that wrong. All right, let me show you some of the other um, Valentine's products that we've got for our collection. So there are three Valentine's fragrances that Scentsy has, and I have all of them in the waxes. I actually have two sets. We've already burned through one set. This is my second set. And then I've got another set that we've ordered that's on the way. So there are three fragrances in this collection. We'll start with Starburst Sky. See the little clouds? Isn't that cute? So this one is actually my favorite of the collection. It's got apples. It's got vanilla. It's got 
Well, let me just read you the description. Let's see. Sweet apple mesmerized by whipped vanilla and a creamy coconut clouds against an amber blossom sunset. Oh my goodness, it's so good. So it's not too fruity. It's just, it's very sweet and mild and it makes such a great scent. I love it in the bathroom. I love it in the bedroom, um, in the living room. It's good anywhere. It's this pretty light pink color. And it's my favorite of the collection. I love it. So, Starburst Sky. If you don't get any of them, try this one. Okay. The next one in the collection that we have is Clementine Blossom. See the little flowers and the clementines, which y'all know is just a little tangerine. Oh my gosh. I love them all. All right. This is, if you love Cutie Pie Cupcake or... What is it? Uh, is it Clementine Cupcake? Oh, they're so good. So if you love those, you're going to love this. It's got an orange creamsicle kind of smell to it. Since he says Clementine Blossom is golden citrus, surprises pink nectar with a sugar blossom treat. Mm, it's not really bakery as much as it's just citrus and sweet. And I don't even really smell a lot of floral in it, but it's really a good one. Okay. The last one, it's Pink Sunshine. And you can see behind there, see the peaches, what looks like peaches and pears and, and roses. So this one surprised me. I don't think it smells that great when it's cold. Let me tell you what Cincy says though. And I have coworkers that smelled it and they're like, oh, that's delicious. So on cold, I would just say it's okay. It's not bad, but it's not delicious. This, But when it's warmed, it smells so good. So we've been warming through all the waxes so that I could tell you about them. And um, it's really interesting to me how some of them really change when you get them warmed up. Some of the other scent notes come out. And uh, I still smell it cold. And I think ah, it just doesn't sound, smell that exciting to me. But when you warm it, it's very good. And it's a little bit stronger than the um, Starburst Sky. It worked out really well in my um, living room that has the raised ceilings. So Cincy says that, that uh, Pink Sunshine is lush pear and plum cozy up with cashmere and a glass of rose milk. I think maybe it's that rose that I'm smelling on cold, and I'm I'm just not real excited about some of the floral scents, but um, it's so interesting to me how it smells different when it's warmed up. So you should at least try it before you completely say it's not for you, because sometimes these scents will surprise you. So that is pink sunshine, okay? So those are the three scents that we have for the Valentine's collection. So now we've got several products that you can get in those scents. One of the products that I got in my order was a um, mini fan bundle, okay? And so we have these little mini fan diffusers, and here is the one that came in the bundle, okay? The two bundles that are available, they have a mini fan in this light pink, it's kind of a blush pink color, it looks kind of white on the video, but it's really pink, okay? And um, you can get the mini fan diffuser and a set of pods for $20. And so the pods alone are $10. The mini fan diffuser, oops, by itself is $15. So if you get that bundle, it saves you $5. And this makes a nice little gift, a Valentine's gift for your teenage daughters, your college age kiddos. Um... Anybody that has a desk or a car would love one of these. So if you haven't used one yet, it has, if I can find it, a little, um, it takes a little USB cord that comes with it. You plug it in and this tiny little fan starts spinning, okay? What you do is you take one of these pods out and place it in there and you have instant fragrance, okay? These pods are supposed to last about 120 hours. Oh, that's so good. And you know what? When you turn it on, you have instant fragrance. There's no waiting for wax to melt. 
you have instant it's instant okay and when you want it to stop you just unplug it and so um i like to keep one in, I'm going to put this pink one in my car because I've got a, a silver one in there. And I just think the pink is pretty for Valentine's Day. So I'm going to put that in there. Um, but I've had them at my at my desk at work before. And, you know, you can just plug it in and let it run while you're at your desk. And maybe for the afternoon you have to go to meetings or something. You're not going to be in there. Just unplug it. And that will save your pod and make it last even longer. Okay. These pods are also great in our... Um, wall fan diffusers we've got a couple of them in our bathrooms upstairs um they're filled with little scent beads let me see if you can see if i get real close can you see those little plastic beads in there when i turn it you can kind of see them moving so those are little scent infused beads that they're good and you don't have to worry about wax or there being a mess if you're you have littles that want to play in it or pets or something um these uh, pods are a great scent. scent system. Okay, so those two bundles are part of our, our Valentine's collection. I did get one of the Starburst Sky hand creams. Oh, can you see? There it goes. See with the little heart-shaped hot air balloons? It's just cute. All right, so... Those of you that know me personally know I wash my hands so many times a day because I work in healthcare. And in the wintertime, my hands, if I don't take good care of them, they will get chapped and um, just really dry. And so I use some sort of hand cream many, many times during the day. I love our hand cream because it's not greasy. And I can put it on my hands and then I can pick up a pencil and start writing with it. And then, you know, I don't have this slick greasy feel to my hands i keep a tube of scentsy hand cream in my purse in my car at my desk at work and on my nightstand here at home i love it and so the starburst sky oh my gosh love it love it i kind of wish the hand cream also came in the um, clementine blossom because i think it would be really good in that too but this is the only scent Mm, smells so good. This is the only scent that the Valentine's collection comes in the hand cream, okay? All right. Two more things. Um, let's do the oils first, and then I've got a buddy to show you, okay? So, you know, since he has several scent delivery systems, we've got the wax and warmers. We've got the pods and the little wall fan diffusers. And we have diffusers and uh, oils. We have essential oils and we have natural oils, okay? So the Valentine's collection has a three-pack of oils. This is the Valentine's Day oil three-pack. They are five millimeter, milliliter oils. Isn't that a cute packaging? It comes in this cute little tin. There's your oils. Call me sweet talk and that last one's not one to crazy for you, all right? In the top of your tin, you're going to get this little fold-out card that has the scent descriptions. Okay, let me tell you about them. All right. So this is crazy for you. This is kind of a flowery. I have to read it in a minute. I think that's got some rose in it. Let's see. Isn't that crazy? Sometimes my nose plays tricks on me. All right. Crazy for you. Bold strawberry embraces rosewood. That's the rosy smell. With a sweet kiss of caramel. So I think it's that rosewood that I'm smelling. You know... The flowery scent, scents are not quite my favorite. So let's see what else we got in here. It's not bad. It's just flowery, which is probably very appropriate for Valentine's Day. We've got to have some rose scents in there somewhere, right? Um, and then Sweet Talk is the next one. See the little Valentine on the cake, on the um, bottle. That's so cute. Little Valentine's. All right. Ah, that one's better. Sweet Talk. 
playful orange zest and cherry blossom nuzzled with an alluring hint of violet. The violet is not too strong. It really does smell fruity. So y'all know that's right up my alley, right? Orange and cherry. Whoop. That's sweet talk. The orange cherry and violet. Hint to violet, but it's not very floral. Okay, the last one is... There it goes. Call me. See the little phone on there? It's an old-fashioned kind of phone. <laughs> oh, that one. Oh, that's my favorite. Oh, my goodness, that's good. It smells sweet and... What is that? Vanilla, maybe? Yum. All right, let's see what Call Me says. Coconut mingles with a flirtatious note of juicy pear and vanilla. Oh, it's that like coconut and vanilla. Yum. All right, this is the first one that we use. This is uh, Call Me. There it goes. Call Me. Oh, yum. I'm going to leave that out. All right. The last thing that I have to show you that we got from the Valentine's collection is the Buddy. Now, there were two. Uh, we've got a Buddy and a Buddy Clip in our Valentine collection. The Buddy Clip is a gnome, and he's cute as can be, but I did not get the gnome Buddy Clip because I wanted the Buddy. So, my boys are about to get really too big to play with the Buddies, but I like to use them to decorate with. So, I'll put... I did that with our Christmas buddies, and I just sort of set them on the shelf um, with some of our Christmassy things, and I think they look cute. Um, and then if we have any little people that come over, they all know they can take down those buddies and drag them anywhere around the house, and they can play with those, okay? So our buddy, I take him out of, the, out of the box and look at him. So this, look, I love him. He may be my favorite thing from the collection. Although, that Call Me Oil is really good in the Starburst sky. There's so many. So, that's why I had to be a consultant so I could have all the sensey things. Alright, so this is, let me make sure I get this right, Benny Boo Boo the Bear. So, I guess he's a boy. He's got a boy's name, but you could call him anything you want to. He kind of looks like a girl. He's all pink. Alright, but look at these cheeks. See his little cheeks are blushed. How cute is that? All right. And he's got the little ears that have the hearts in it. I'm trying to get it to focus. And he just has this minky soft fur. It's just soft as can be. See, he's got a white um, heart on his belly. And his hands and feet have the, have the hearts. That one says Scentsy. He's got this little patch on the back. His little bottom matches the rest of his legs. He's got, here's his little pocket for his scent pack. And you get to pick any scent pack that you want to go in, Benny. Now, I really wish that Scentsy had offered scent packs in the Valentine's Day fragrances because you know which one I would have got. He would have had a Starburst Sky scent pack for sure. But they were not offered, so we got him a, um, a, which one did I get? I think I got. Uh, cashmere and corduroy. So, but I sat that down. I think it's over there in the box. So, um, we'll put his scent pack in him in a few minutes. But isn't he cute? So, he would make such a cute little buddy. And, um, he's going to go on the shelf, toy shelf down here, on the top of the toy shelf with some of our other Valentine's little decorations. And that's all of my Valentine's collection so far. There is another warmer in the collection. It is the, um, I think it's a pink champagne warmer that um, is very similar to our Glisten warmer, but it's got what looks like um, pink sprinkles on the outside. And then, um, of course, the Gnome Buddy, we didn't get that. But um, all the rest of it is here. So, if you got anything from the Valentine's Day collection, leave a comment below and tell me what you got. And especially if you got that warmer, let me know if that's something I need to add to my wish list. Um, I'm kind of on the fence about it, but, uh, you know, January we get double half price party rewards. And so 
I may use one of my rewards and get one of the Valentine's warmers. I'm still thinking about it. And if you smell these waxes, tell me what you think. Are you going to add them to your club? Do you, which one is your favorite? Do you love Starburst Sky as much as I do? Ah, yum. Um, it's already in my club. Starburst Sky is already in our club. And Clementine Blossom is probably going in there too. We've got to revise the club before the end of the month. Oh my goodness. They're so good. Thanks for watching. And I hope y'all are having a happy day. And um, thanks. Uh, be sure to like and share my video so that other people will be able to see it too. Thank you. Bye-bye.